I often get asked, um, how do I know if I need a coach or what would I go and see a coach for? There are a whole range of different reasons, which include things like feeling very stuck or feeling overwhelmed, just having too much to do and perhaps you've lost focus. Confidence is another one that we often see. People feel they're lacking confidence or even self-belief. Um, and as we know in, in this world, confidence is incredibly important in terms of being su successful at work and more assertive at work. Uh, we have people who just say they don't know where they're going or what they really want, so they feel a bit lost um, and maybe they need some direction. I've seen procrastinators, perfectionists, um, who know that that is actually holding them back from getting to where they want to go to. Uh, people who want a promotion as well. Um, perhaps they're being overlooked for a promotion and that's, so they want to sort of improve their performance or the way they lead um, to help them open up the chances of actually getting promoted. Uh, people moving into new roles as well, so uh, sometimes people might be moved into a much bigger role where they've got to take on a lot more responsibility and they want to do it really, really well. So they might engage with a coach to help uh, plan um, and give them a bit of guidance about where they want to go. Purpose is another area. Um, again, people who feel unchallenged, uh, bored or maybe too much in their comfort zone, for example. That can tend to point to not really knowing where I'm going or, or what's the purpose of all this, why am I doing it all? So a coach would work with them to sort of discover uh, where their focus is or what is meaningful to them. So there really are a whole different range of, of spaces and places uh, that we can dig into and explore. The other area is also ourselves in terms of holding ourselves back. Um, it can be one of those things where we know we're the one who's preventing us from achieving something, but we don't know what the specific thing is. Maybe a belief or a value, negative talk, self-talk, self-criticism. How do we actually address those and come up with solutions that allow someone to actually move forward um, and get to where they want to go?